Hello, my friends. How are you doing? Happy Thursday. All right. So this is an improv live. And the reason for it is because I have been procrastinating, sharing the how to find the perfect name for your video podcast with a really good friend of mine. So she's been asking me for a while. She sent me an email and I figured the best way to get to it is just to record a video get to it get the video done and just send it to her so here we go i'm going to do that for her and i'm going to take advantage of the opportunity and just share that with everybody so we're going to go ahead and get that done i got my notes here and i got a beautiful view a beautiful sunset let's do that and get it all together for all of you and i got my notes here so um, hopefully you can hear me and we can get it all done so the very first step that you're gonna do when you're trying to get the name down for your video podcast is you're gonna start with a white Canva, okay? You're gonna put all your ideas down to paper. Write it all down. There is no right or wrong or good or bad idea. So hopefully you can hear me uh, because there's a little bit of a breeze here. Um, but just put all your ideas down to paper, write it all down, and maybe this is um, through a, a few days. It doesn't have to happen just in one time. So take your time and put your ideas down. And sometimes for me, I think through these uh, ideas when I'm driving. So I park on the side of the road and I put it on my phone. And sometimes um, when I'm in bed and I have to get up and get out of bed and um, put it on a piece of paper. Um, so take your time, okay? Don't rush through it. Uh, but the idea is just do that brain dump over time and then once you feel like okay you have done your homework you put your ideas down to paper um, then move on on to the second step so that was step number one put all your ideas down to paper so step number two is kind of like to look around okay and that doesn't mean like you're gonna be like sneaking around and look around at what other people are going to are doing or um, and, and some people call it like looking at your competition. I actually don't like that name. I don't like looking at competition, okay? Um, I don't like competition because to me it doesn't exist. And I'm going to give you a really good, actually there is a car passing by making a lot of noise, so let's stop here a little bit. Um, hello, how are you doing? Um, so for me, why doesn't competition exist? And this is the analogy that I use. The ocean is wide and deep, and I'm gonna show you the ocean right now so you can see what I'm talking about. You see that ocean is wide and deep, right? That means if the ocean is wide and deep, there's enough fish, enough fish for everybody, right? This car making a lot of noise. Actually, it's a motorcycle. Let's wait for the motorcycle to pass. So what I was saying about point number two with regards to looking for the perfect name for your video podcast. When I say look around, is look around for inspiration, for motivation. Some people uh, like looking around and they're like, oh, you're looking for your competition. No, I personally don't like calling it competition because for me, the word competition doesn't exist. I don't like competition. I call it inspiration because I don't compare myself with anyone. Because as I was saying with the ocean, is the ocean is wide enough and deep enough and there is enough fish for everyone, right? Therefore, there shouldn't be competition. You shouldn't call it competition. As a matter of fact, if there is enough for everyone, because there is abundance, that means it's healthy. If there is um, enough market, if they can sell, that means you can sell. If there is enough market for them, that means there is enough market for you, okay? So that was point number two. So once you have put down to paper all those names and ideas that you have, 
um, then you're going to look around for those ideas and inspiration for the name of your video podcast. Hello, everyone. Okay, so that was point number two. Then point number three, which is extremely important, you are going to look for SEO. And the reason being is because you don't want to be the Internet's best kept secret, do you? No, you don't. You really want to make sure that once you have found the name that you want for your video podcast, you want people to find you. That is why it's so important that you um, are looking for keywords and key phrases that people are searching for. So you want to ensure that you are actually going to places such as Google or you're going to places like YouTube, which are the two largest search engines in the world. Okay, so we got Google and then we got YouTube, which is owned by Google. And you're going to start typing like the words. You're going to put yourself in the shoes of your clients, your customers. And you're going to type the words that you think that they are typing. Okay. And then that is going to give you some clues for the things that they're typing for. And it's not like you're going to call your video podcast the same words that they're typing or you're going to call it exactly the same thing that um, they, that is going to solve the problem, but you're going to strategically perhaps going to put a few of those words within the name of your video podcast, okay? So that was point number two. So point number one, you're going to do that brain dump put it onto your white Canva. Point number two, you're going to look around for inspiration or motivation. Point number three, you're going to make sure that you're putting some of those SEO keywords, key phrases. Now, point number four, you are going to look within iTunes. And the reason for looking into iTunes is because you want to make sure that the um, name of the video podcast that you're looking into is not taken already, all right? Because the last, last thing that you want to do is to go ahead and then get really excited and have the name of your video podcast selected and create the art. And then once you have the art and all that and you are uploading it onto um, um, Apple and a Stitcher and all those, and then when you upload it, then figure out that it gets rejected because somebody already has that name. So make sure that you do your homework and that you look up onto those platforms and that though that name has not been taken already by somebody else. Um, and the last thing, and this is a really good trick that I like sharing with my students at Video Podcast Academy, there is a platform which is free within the internet that is called Namevine. It's www.namevine. And when you go in there, you type the name that you have selected. And once you type it, it gives you actually the overall view if that name is available across all social media platforms except the ones for podcast. And that is why, hence, you're looking into iTunes if it's available there. But it does give you the availability of that name if it's available within uh, Instagram, Facebook, um, LinkedIn, and so on, and YouTube. So the idea is um, when you are creating your video podcast, you're probably looking into not only creating one platform, you're looking into uh, launching a video podcast as a platform for your greater or um, a bigger launch for your overall content strategy. So make sure that you're looking at this availability for that name across multiple platforms, across multiple social media platforms. Because again, the last thing that you want to do is to go ahead and, oops, the lighting is better here. <laughs> I didn't think about that. Uh, the last thing that you want to do is to launch your video podcast and then figure out that, oh, that name is not available within Instagram or it's not available within Facebook and so on. So let me just give you a recap. We were talking about um, how to come up with the perfect name for your video podcast in the things that we talked about where point number one, you're going to do a brain dump into a piece of paper like you're having a white Canva, 
okay that's point number one point number two you're going to be looking around for inspiration not looking at competition because competition doesn't exist just like you're looking at that ocean over there the ocean is wide and deep and there is plenty of fish for everybody so remember that my friends there is no competition just inspiration and motivation so look at that for inspiration make sure that you're searching for SEO okay make sure that you're looking for what people are searching for you don't want to be the internet's best kept secret my friend don't do that to yourself point number three search within iTunes make sure that the name of your video podcast is available within iTunes before you even create the art and you invest on anything else point number four I mean that was four point number five go look into www name vine to ensure that the name of your video podcast is available across all social media platforms YouTube Instagram LinkedIn and so on so that way you can capitalize on the name of your video podcast and you can grow it even greater than just video podcast but across all the social media platforms and that is it my friends I love you all Mwah. I hope that was helpful and if you have any questions just DM me I'm here to help you and support you and if you want to learn more about video podcasting let me know the uh, wait list for video podcast Academy is open just hit that um, link in bio the wait list is open and let me know if there is anything else I can help you with I'll see you soon <music>